What is up everyone? This is SoraKing090 and this is going to be week 21 of the weekly vlogs where I update you guys what's been going on, especially when I need to be working out until the end of the year to see if I'm going to win the competition with all the other co-workers with the pool money. So let's hope that I win. If not, then I failed myself and I failed you guys. So what's been going on this week that I was able to actually upload a few of the videos of the thunderstorm that I did say last week. It took a while. I've been busy with a lot of different stuff and now I was able able to actually upload them all and now I have one more video to upload and then that is the slow motion replay or instant replay of the lightning and the flashes that occurred in the video itself so people actually wanted to see some slow motion clips of the actual lightning strikes so it took me a little bit of a while it took 18 minutes well first of all 18 minutes to review the video and then take all the best clips like the lightning strikes and then the good old flashes because some of the flashes actually made everything as bright as day so that was actually pretty cool depending on what your perspective is about it but i had a lot of lightning strikes in there so or lightning bolts however you want to call it at this point it was a good old thunderstorm i love thunderstorms we don't get that many but when we do i just absolutely love it especially when it was right in the backyard because most of the time it would be in the front yard and of course i can't film anything in the front yard because i don't want my camera to get wet but it was luckily that I was in the backyard and I was very happy about that and I was able to get 20 minutes before the camera died. Sadly, I didn't actually charge up the battery and especially when there were a few blackouts, I just couldn't risk actually damaging the battery. So that was quite annoying. But in any case, that, that video is going to be uploaded soon, so stay tuned for that one. And I was able to learn a little bit more editing, so I'm very, very happy. It's just I made a... 10% clip out of every original clip which would take a 5 second video into 50 seconds so yeah I had to do a lot of editing here because otherwise you would be waiting 30 seconds before something finally happened so I had to take all that dead space out but in any case in any case that I was able to actually live stream for the first time in a long time and I'm glad that my license doesn't expire to March so I have a lot of time to actually save up more money to actually extend the license so I'll be able to live stream even more. If I were to do frequent live streams, I'll be very, very happy about that because I'll be able to actually do more stuff with that, like play different games or do other stuff that, I don't know, that it would be a lot more fun. Just hang out with people, make a group party chat, and just have fun playing different video games. And one thing I could possibly do, if I were to do Twitch more often, that I could possibly do one of the things that one other person has done before. It's kind of crazy, but it was kind of interesting too because it could actually help me out as well. Like every new follower, I do a push-up. Every new follower, I do a, like, a dip where pretty much you have your triceps, you work out your triceps and you lower yourself to the ground and you bring yourself back up. So you're gonna work out your triceps and your pectorals. Or if I were to do a sit up every new follower or top like that, then that could actually be a thing. I could actually work out while I'm actually live streaming. Of course, probably gonna have to have a webcam directed towards the back wall so that people could actually see me do a workout without I'm not faking it. So it's like, that's gonna be kind of interesting. Like if I were to get raided for some odd reason and more people start following, then that's more exercises for me. Then I could get myself pumped and as well as I could do a live stream and then I could be entertaining for the people who are actually just going along with the whole thing. So we don't know how things are going to play out, but it's kind of like a fun thing to actually look forward to. A good raid, not a bad raid, but a good raid. But that's all I could really say so far. I've already live streamed Banjo Kazooie. I'm going to finish that up one of these days. Don't know exactly when it could already be finished up. I don't even know at this point that I already did the first half and I got to finish up with the second half. I'm really learning more about the whole live streaming aspect, especially when I can't really do 60 frames per second. I had to lower it down to 30 frames because it takes more memory and it takes more processing power to do 60 frames constantly. So at this point, I'm not able to do 60 frames, which I'm kind of sad about, but at least I know. Just lower it down to 30 frames and then I should be good. Not too sure, but fingers crossing that it'll actually be good. Well, that, there's nothing really else to say. I gotta go on a diet, I gotta do more exercises, and maybe next week I'll actually talk about one of the things I'm thinking about, especially when it could actually help people out. Just mainly it is an illusion type of deal, but it is one of the things that a lot of people do. 
It's not Photoshop or anything. It is legitimate and it could actually work. So if I could actually figure out more about it, then I'll let you guys know. Maybe I'll actually do a video in a separate day. Then I could actually just pretty much type it all in the description and then possibly explain it later on in a different video like following up. So I don't know if you guys actually understand that, but in my head, it actually makes sense of what I'm actually going to do. And when I upload it, then it'll actually make perfect sense. And then I do a follow up and explain everything. So how I really do things, it really just doesn't make sense until you actually see it. But all I could say is that I really got to start working out more and I cannot wait. I really have yet to finish up my room. There's a lot of stuff in my room that I'm throwing out. So at least I'm cleaning it up little by little by little. I got to move the total gym to the living room because my father actually wants to use it. But there's not enough space in the actual living room because we're going to have to move some furniture around as well. So it's a step by step progress. But in any case, that's all I got to say. Hope you enjoyed this video. Have a great day, everyone. I'm Sir King 090 And as always, I will see you in the next video.